Hi everyone, Steve Backlin here. I want to share more on glistening hope. I shared previously that every area of our life that doesn't glisten with hope means we're believing a lie. And that area is a stronghold of the devil in our life. So literally every area where we don't have great hope, we're believing lies. And when I first heard this, I realized that was pretty much every area of my life. But the Lord used that to begin to transform the way I thought. And I want to just say this again. Our hope level determines whether we're believing lies or truth. If we have a lot of hope, we're believing a lot of truth. If we don't have much hope, we're believing a lot of lies. And there's no condemnation if you're watching this right now and you realize, hey, I'm believing a lot of lies. But how many of you know if you don't know what your problem is, you have a real problem. I shared out of Hebrews 10, 23, where it says, Let us hold fast the confession of our hope without wavering, for he who promised is faithful. The more I believe he's faithful is the more hope I'll have in my heart and the more hope I'll speak. Romans 15, 13 says this, Now may the God of hope fill you with all joy and peace in believing that you may abound in hope by the power of the Holy Spirit. That verse could be just simplified to this. Now may the God of hope fill you in believing. So the moment I start believing truth is the moment I get filled. I get filled, I get filled until it gets to my eyes and I'm actually seeing things differently. I'm seeing me differently. I'm seeing the people in my life differently. I'm seeing my circumstances differently. I have this step that I would like you to take. I would like you to just take a truth and I would like you just to meditate on it, a truth of God, like the promise that he's going to provide for you or you can do all things through Christ and meditate that and get that in your mouth and keep doing it until you feel your hope level rising. Hope is the evidence that the renewing of the mind is working. God bless you.